up Lambros, it's stevecurrington.com. If you're new to the channel, I'm Lambro Steve. And today, I have some very interesting news. Look who's calling me. Oh, somebody just got off the plane. We're at Tulsa International Airport picking up Evil Mercy Lago. Let's see what he has to say. What up, Jimmy? Sweet, I'm out front. And uh, I'm vlogging and this is going on the vlog right now. So I'm out right by Southwest. Do you have bags to pick up? Do you have any? Sweet. All right, dude, I'm in the Bentley. Just come out and look left. Later, bro. All right, he just landed. Good timing. So my Lamborghini is broken. You may know this by now if you watch my channel. Um, if you haven't, I'll put a uh, I'll put a link somewhere that says go find out what happened to my Lamborghini. So uh, we did get some news today on uh, what's going to happen with it, uh, which I think I'm a little a bit conflicted on it. Um, you know, it's a uh, bittersweet. Uh, I'm not going to quite share that yet. Um, I do need to share that news with James, and I thought it would be great when he comes out. I'm going to share that news with him, and we will film his reaction to what is going to happen in the. Uh, coming days i guess for my lamborghini huracan and stay tuned now and make sure you make comments on what you think is really happening with my lamborghini huracan but we will have james teague's reaction shortly stay tuned okay lambros i'm back and i'm here with none other than uh evil murcielago now we have some super cool news about your car because there's a couple cool things coming uh the new wrap is almost done hopefully by the you think by this friday better be by this friday oh dude this week yeah but james i got news today mm -hmm. about my car let's hear it what's the verdict well i have to, I have to read it to you because i don't understand all this jargon that these car guys talk about i do own a lamborghini but i don't really know what all the parts do so just heard back from the factory it looks like when the bolt backed out of that camshaft, one piston contacted two of the valves, which I guess is bad, in that cylinder head. The factory is having us replace the engine. All right, that's good news. Brand under new Under warranty. Brand new motor, yeah. and they're gonna cover under it. Under warranty. So the factory is having us replace it due to parts and custom problems. I don't really have an ETA yet. So. That's the bittersweet. So I'm definitely getting a new engine. It's definitely covered under warranty. The only bitter is it's gonna take longer to get yes. the car back. The sweet That's, is you're gonna have a brand new I engine. know. So we're gonna take a 39,156 mile Huracan and we're gonna put a brand new engine in it. So it's gonna have zero miles on that new engine. And I'm pretty excited about that, but I'm not excited about being gone. So here's the deal. How long do you think it's gonna take? I mean, it has to go through customs and parts. Like, what do you guys think? I mean, do you think it's going to be like a two-month project? Is no, it going to be like a... 30 days max. You think so? Yeah. Okay, days. I think it'll be longer than that. Somebody told me nine months. No. Other, you know what? Uh, you know our friend John, our, that works on these things here, Reeves. I'll, I'll share. I don't know if I've shared this with you either. Uh, John says, <laughs> anyone on the internet can slay the tires, but it takes a real man to slay the whole effing engine. Good job. I'm subscribing today. Hey, that is two in a row. I know. Two that's so right. exactly what I blew up a guy. Oh, the, the engine slayer. I don't. No kidding. The engine slayer. That's my new thing. Yeah. Woo. Oh engine my god. Slayer. We're gonna be. The, it's gonna be the engine slayer. And then we're sitting here at the airport, and people are just driving around us, probably wondering what are these guys doing, yeah. filming a video in the with their light on. So anyway. We'll be back. Okay, we did make it to Jimmy Teak's house and uh, we must say hello to Bam Bam. Bam Bam, what are you doing there? What, what are you doing? You just hanging out on the bed? Oh, she's gonna come get this camera? I am gonna get attacked by a deer this time. Here, baby. You just sleeping? You just relaxing? You just chilling? What you doing? What's up, Bam? Well, Jimmy, What's up, Bam? Bam is just hanging out. Skyly's here. Um, it's going to be a fun night, but you you can't watch. You got to tune in to the next video. Uh, this is the bonus footage. Oh, we, we haven't even shown what's in this tube yet. Oh, okay. Well, we'll be back in a minute with what's in the tube. You'll see. It'll be cool. 
Okay, what happened was, we got, look, it's all wrap materials, because Jimmy bought some new wrap for, where's the Little Mercy Lago out? Is that out in the garage? No, it's at the, uh, it's, it's at, at the, the wrap, wrap shop. shop. Yeah, waiting on this to get in. Wait. So the Mercy's been waiting, or the Little Baby Mercy, for the baby baby, has been waiting on the wrap. Look at that, that's like a pink glitter, what is that? Bedazzled like, pink. It's like bedazzled. Little it's crazy. bedazzled. So stay tuned because I think maybe later this week we'll be going to see the new wrap on the uh, Mercy Largo and then you will see the baby Mercy getting wrapped as well. Don't you love Bam Bam? Stay tuned. What is up Lambros? It's stevecurrington.com. If you are new to the channel, I'm Lambro Steve. Now I do have a Lamborghini Huracan, which I'm not in right now because I'm on my Lexus. This is like, you know, the sort of daily driver. I kind of trade back between this one and my Bentley and my Lambo. But right now, we're a little sad because the Lamborghini is broken and it's getting a new engine, but uh, all covered under warranty, so we're happy about that. But I am in Tulsa, Oklahoma today. Um, we've been waiting and waiting and waiting for Evil Mercy Lago, the um, wide body Mercy Lago, to get the new wrap on it. And it has happened now. So the wrap is done, and in just a few minutes, I will be sneaking in to the shop where they're wrapping it to get some crazy video of it. I've already seen some pictures. I've actually already seen a video of it. It's hot. You're gonna love it. I think you guys are gonna like it. Um, I'm gonna head over to Kryptonite Customs here in Tulsa. We're just a couple miles away after I put my seatbelt on, and we will check it out. So stay tuned, I will be back. If you cannot tell in the background, I am at Kryptonite Customs. They have a really cool, they wrap their glass on the front. So it's actually a huge warehouse and you're gonna see these guys are doing awesome. So they have, uh, they've done uh, James's uh, Mercy Log, I think three or four times now. And they actually moved over to a much larger facility because they do big stuff like that. Plus, they're probably gonna wrap that. Semis, everything. So let's go in here and check out the Mercy and then I'll do a good walkthrough of the entire, I'll give you a good walk around of the entire Mercy Log but. I'm looking at it just about right now and it's sick. So let's go in here and check it out. Oh my God. Wow. It's cool. Here we go. Okay, I fast forwarded. <laughs> we had to turn off music. <laughs> so here we go. Here is the. He's getting a new emblem. Whoop. Focus now. He's getting a new emblem. Which will go right here. Actually, I'll probably cut out the wrap and stick it on there brand new but look at this look how wet it looks Danger on here, putting a beware jet blast. Probably gonna go right there, I'm guessing. Oh my god. Guys, you have to see this in person if they detail the whole engine bay. This is a very sick wrap. Oh my god. Look at this place, too, by the way. She's driving that bus. It's a big hauler. He does all car stuff. I think it's literally like triple the size of their their other shop. But um, let's see what this.
That's it, guys. That is the Evil Mercy Logo, the infamous Evil Mercy Logo. I have a feeling, based on the extra stickers that are going here, that people will be warned about the flamethrower in the back now. Uh, check out Chris, Kryptonite Customs. Chris is amazing. As I told you guys outside, he's done this car several times and can do about everything. Here's some of the you know, samples of colors they'll do. It's pretty, pretty hot and amazing. But I know James thrilled with the wrap. I'm sure you are, too. Now, coming are new tires and new tire stickers and all that. And so it'll literally be ready to launch uh very soon once he gets the tires on so thanks for tuning in make sure you like subscribe turn on notifications all that fun stuff we'll see you in the next video